The recession has hit the New Mexico construction industry very hard. But as is often the case, someone's loss is someone else's gain. News 13's Kim Vias went to a record-breaking auction in Albuquerque today. Hopeful buyers filled the auction theater at Ritchie Brothers in Albuquerque. Eight, six, six, hoping to get a deal. We try to buy traders. What do you got down here, Butch? You got Every type of construction equipment you can imagine is up for sale, from backhoes and asphalt pavers to cement trucks. Most are being sold by big construction and rental companies. A lack of business has left them sitting. They're now turning into much-needed cash. It's been a tough first quarter, so it's... Uh... I'm hoping it gets a little better in the second quarter here. A little harder to buy, a little harder to make a nickel at. The equipment here today is worth about $11.5 million, making this the largest auction of its kind ever in the Albuquerque area. That translates into some good deals for people like contractor Robert Manzanares, who's also struggling. I mean, a lot of people are kind of staying away from new stuff, and and uh, and that's why they're. I'm sorry, that's why that's why they're here right now. No. But unfortunately for everyone out here, this is a big risk. No matter which side you're on. You do good some days and you do bad other days. Is it risky investing with the economy how it is, investing in more equipment, putting more money in when you don't really know what's ahead? Yeah, it, it's really risky, but you kind of have to go with your gut. Kim Baez, KRQE News 13. There were about 1,000 bidders at that auction today. 600 were there in person. The others bid on the Internet.